what's up y'all so i wanted to come to y'all to talk um because as you all know i did an actual video um in regards to just like queen and clarence that was my first video actually where you know i was just just me completely just you know observing and just going based off of what i seen what i feel and what i felt that needs to be said um i was just watching an actual video which i'm going to put it in this actual video um but i honestly feel like that Queen's mom actually has said so much without even having to say a whole lot um, which you know just based off of the lines of what she said basically it's like basically you know I'll just say what she said <laughs> well kind of said um, but anyway so she's basically along the lines just saying like you know she thanks God for wisdom and just you know you know doing things with a different approach and just you know really confirming that you know every time that something is done but with God or is brought together by God that it's always great you know and she was just basically saying like basically like sometimes you know you can you can love people or you know what I'm saying you can be there for people or you can tell people stuff but sometimes you have to let people um, basically follow their face that's what I got from it and that's not what she said y'all I was y'all were here word for word what she actually said but I want to know like what do you all think I feel like that this is you know we all know that we're in a social media time so a lot of families or people feel like they have to address or say certain things and of course every time um, she or whoever makes an actual video in regards to their family of course it's always gonna you know be something that's gonna be talked about because we are dealing with people who are you know very very popular youtubers and just you know famous in, in general so it's like I felt like you know at ultimately I feel like this was not necessarily a cry for help but I think that this was just you know um, basically a, a washing of hands it's like okay you know I've tried you know all I can do at this point is leave it in God's hand pray you know I love you whatever whatever I'm here for you but at the end of the day you got to see it for yourself I can no longer try to make you see it and there was a lot of conversations if you you know even if you just check out her actual page itself um, you can actually see the full vlog um, that she actually made um, it's titled like something along the lines like something with chicken in it I forgot but if y'all look at it, um, you know, in full, come back, um, tell me what y'all think. You know, I feel like that she's definitely, I feel like she has been somebody who has been like, you know, queen, whatever, whatever. I do feel like she has tried to address queen or tell her, you know, what she notices or sees. And I just feel like it's one of those things where either she's being ignored or maybe Clarence is in queen's ear. Like, you know, your mom is just trying to come between us as opposed to, you know, really what it is, which is she's looking out for her, son, her actual child. She can tell she has a mother intuition. All mothers are with some mothers um, you know are very good especially if they have a close relationship sometimes with God even with their child they know when things is out of ordinary or when something isn't right whether it's a friend whether it's a spouse whoever um, but other than that you all I just really wanted to have a conversation because I really feel like you know in a nutshell that she was basically saying that you know that she at this point you know people that has her hand in the pot because she was basically saying everybody can't something along the lines of everyone can't have their hand in the pot um, but for those that have their hand in the pot you know you got to address the people that actually made this let this happen which you know that would mean Queen you know Queen is with Clarence Clarence allows stuff to you know not Clarence but Queen allows different things to go on and maybe it's not addressed or maybe when it is addressed it's like you know she'll make a video like no that didn't happen you all or you know try to make it seem like it's something different and then we'll make a video the next day like raiding mom's food or something of the sort but you know um, what do y'all think I feel like that her mom I feel like she is tired I feel like she just looking at it from a mom's point of view um, as well I just feel like she is washing her hands with a lot of different things and she's like look I've tried I love my child but I can't get through her head that you know this is not it or this man isn't it his family isn't it um, but for whatever reasons Queen has not got it and maybe it is because you know it isn't her season to get it a lot of you all are not gonna understand that but sometimes people have to go through different things but y'all let me know in the comments below is a God of peace. He's a God of love. And um, I just want to say that sometimes everybody can't put their hands in a pot. Gotta let, let it. Whoever prepared that pot and whoever involved inside of that pot let them stir and fix that. Everybody's hands can't be in the pot. So what I'm trying to say is when you step back and let God do it, God will fix it every time. And so that's why we shouldn't say things and have a lot of input on things because, you know, um, family is family. And I thank God for peace. 
I thank God for a different approach. I thank God for mending. I thank God for um, unity. Any and everything that God is involved in, it always turns out great. And uh, I'm just thankful, and I'm going to let that be that.